hi welcome to my youtube channel so please before you continue to watch this video don't forget to hit the subscribe button and subscribe to my channel so today i want to show you how to repair microsoft office so let's say you are using microsoft office 2016 or 2019 or even office 3 6 5 apps and you're having issue like receiving error message or uh, microsoft office keeps freezing so it comes to a point where you've tried everything and nothing is working. So the only option you have is to repair Office 365. So I'm going to show you how to actually repair Office if you are having issue with Office. So the first thing to do is, if you can see, I have installed Microsoft Office on this um, computer. I have Access, Excel. Um, I have um, here you see the Office. I have PowerPoint, Publisher, Word, and Outlook as well. So the first option we have to repair Office is by going to your Start menu, and here we need to go to Settings. So in Settings, just type um, Programs. Here we have the options to add or remove programs. So click on Add or Remove Programs. So I have installed Microsoft of Office 365 on this device. So to make my, if I have a long list of programs. On this computer if I just scroll down you can see I have the Microsoft 365 apps but what I can, what I can as well do is to just type um, 365 and you can see that I have just one option of Microsoft 365 apps for enterprise and it's actually English version so what I'm going to do is I'm going to click here click on office and then click modify so if I click modify and then you will receive a pop-up to actually um, allow this app to make changes to your device. Click yes. So if I click yes, you can see I have two options, the quick repair or the online repair. But at the same time, let me just close close this and close this. So let me give you a second option on how to actually go to your programs and future. So if I go to my start menu here, I'm going to tap the app WIZ for dot CPL. So if I tap this and I click on Apps, this is going to take me to my programs and future. So you can see that here I'm actually, right now, I'm actually my control panel. So let me just close this as well. If I go to my control panel, here you see I have my control panel. And in my control panel, we can decide to actually search for programs and future. So if you are opening control panel for the first time, probably your um, icons will be on category so what i actually do is to view by category and change it to large icons so here you can see i have the, um, the option to just search click on programs and features so if i click on programs and future you can see that i don't even need to search you can also search for a program here if you have a long list of programs but if you don't have so much program like i do here you can just click on microsoft 365 apps for enterprise and click change so you have the option to actually uninstall so please don't click uninstall except you want to uninstall office from your device so just click change so you have to accept the yeah just click select yes to allow um, this app to make change to your device and here we have these two options so we have the option to do a quick repair so with the quick repair your, your repair will not go through the internet to actually um, download and fix any um, faults that Outlook or Office have, have. But if you select the online repair, what is going to happen is um, Office is going to go through the internet and download some either some updates or some quick fix to actually fix all issues related to Microsoft Office. So what I actually do, because as an IT, I've come across a uh, situation whereby We've tried different things to actually um, fix a problem with um, Office, but still we couldn't um, solve that problem. So my last um, option is actually to do an online repair. So by online repair, it takes some time for the uh, for Office to be um, kind of reconfigured. But mind you, Office is not going to like reinstall or delete all your um, your program like Excel or Word program you've already saved to your device. So it's going everything is going to still remain the same. So what is going to happen is um, Office is going to go to the internet and download some quick fix. So just click repair. And it says ready to start an online repair. We will download file to repair your installation 
this may take some time and requires an internet connection so click repair you can see that office is trying to see first of all if any program or apps is open it's going to those apps will be closed and uh, you will be required to close those apps then office is just going to take some time and download any file that are required and repair your Microsoft Office 365 or Microsoft Office 2019. So I'm going to pause this video and come back again if the repair has been completed because this may take some take some time. So I'm um, here. You can see that Office is trying to actually download. Um, it's, 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 it, it, it looks as if Office is trying to download all the apps again from the internet. But what is try what is going on is this: if you have any Excel or Word document you save, PowerPoint, um, Access or Outlook, nothing is going to change from your device. Like if, if you've configured Outlook before, you you are you don't need to kind of reconfigure Outlook. Um, again, or even like if you have Skype or you have Microsoft Teams, you don't need to go reconfigure them um, again on your device. So this is going to take some time. Going to download everything from the internet and fix any problem you are having with Microsoft 365 apps. So here you can see that Office is being repaired. You can see I just received a message that installation is finished. Your Office product is now complete, completely installed. And you're all, you are, you are all set, Office is installed now. So what you need to do is just click close. And here we can as well minimize this. And when I open, uh, let me just try to open Excel for the first time. You can see that here I'm opening Excel for the first time. And if I open Excel, you can see we have Excel is open. Let me just close this. And yes, so you can see that um, um, Office has been fixed. So if you're having any problem, if you have like error, you're receiving any error message, or um, Office is uh, Excel or Microsoft Outlook is freezing all the time, I think after doing doing a, doing a repair is going to resolve your problem. My name is Kelvin Johnson. Please, if this video has been of any help to you, don't forget to share my video. You can like my video as well, and also leave a comment, and I'll reply to you as quick as possible.